and hello everybody to part two of the attack on the arachnid nest sorry for the crash of uh, which kenshi had before um it was more than just a little bit annoying for me um and as we have really decimated the arachnid guys um now um, i think in a few moments we are going to let the dogs loose meaning that we will give our guys the order to attack all um, and i can't wait to see yukitaka uh, with this uh, guandao in action it looks so damn cool i'm right now thinking of making a full unit of of uh, pull arm wheelers just to see that action uh, that weapon in action more um, we're gonna make sure that we're still fighting uh, and so let's let's see how we do Shingen yeah you got a big hit in here um, right attack that guy and you know what as you're the leader of us I want to see how you do on a one-on-one -on -one. 23 that's 5 mm, 23 come on get him again yeah 23 come on get a big hit in yes Shing and tell them how it's done yet yeah. oh. yes no, very nice you're doing good my friend okay but that warrior is gonna be a bit to bite for you so your guys are gonna be supporting you because we need heavily armored guys to fight someone like that you see he made 59 damage and the armor subtracted 82 already so these weapons they hit freaking hard yeah that that was a nice step Shingen is doing fine my left leg is already damaged off that arachnid guy yeah come on get them and come on guys you get him down you three versus one you, yes that was a nice swing Mazotoyo yeah and the broadsword he has is freaking nice only 11 kilo and 2.11 cutting damage that's very nice damage so let's see how Shingen does in his one-on-one -on -one duel all his warriors watching and he needs to get some reinforcements as the spider kisses seem to be getting reinforcements in you're gonna act like that and you are so right yeah and Shingen defeated his first guy in open combat um, he got one point of dexterity for it and he increased his melee attack and defense which is very nice he's at 32 35 now he's getting more and more close to his guys and look at Sonayori ah, that was a mean hack with that weapon yes you're hacking him really bad very good yeah and these guys also go down quickly yeah very very good so the four of you attack him and you too as you don't have anything to do you're just gonna go for that spider right and as more and more guys are pouring in, Takeda gives the Bansai order. Bansai! Clans attack. Right? Okay, we're gonna make a tactical move here. We're gonna take everyone off waiting for allies. And we're gonna tactically move you guys over there. 
and you over here. So we're going to have some flanking action here. Um, and as you see, it was the right decision. You're going to be attacking all. And you two are going to take that guy. And the three of you are concentrating on him. And that's a lot of green I see down there. Okay, but we got numerical superiority. Superiority. <laughs> um, so that's really nice looking here. So uh, I said hold, off hold. Right? Clan Usugi, you are free to. Okay. But that might be a little bit too much for you to bite. Two versus one? Nah, I don't think so. Get your clan mates here. Right? Okay, you can, you can attack guys. Right? Okay, everybody storm in. Yeah, that's what I want to see. Right? That's a lot of green. Yeah, the clans are crushing them. Ooh, and here we got a heavy hitter. Yeah, but he's swarmed by some of our guys. Yes. Nobutaka swinging his... Yeah, very nice. Um, heal up your leg. Uh, oh Yamada, this, this, just, this hack stuff, I just like this weapon so much. It's freaking effective and it looks v damn cool. Um, as we can see here, the effectivity of it, I think so. No, that was a, a pole arm striking, right? But we are crushing them. We are crushing the Arachnid scouts. Um, right. Okay, there's some spiders coming. Watch out, guys. Yeah, but you're doing fine. We obliterated them. Very nice. I'm very satisfied. <coughs> Nobushige. Yeah, very, very nice. Perfect. All right. So, Nobutamo, you're gonna loot this guy right away. Take the limbs and the swords and this, and you loot this guy also. That's a thousand two hundred. We're gonna take it. And we are taking the limbs, the bandages and all. Uh, we're going to have some really decent loot here. But I'm... And... We're going to free all the slaves. I'm thinking about eventually recruiting the the Scorchlander ones, but I'm not sure. Uh, we're gonna free them in any case. And let's say, yeah. Okay, what we are going to do now is um, what I want to do is I want to separate the Ursugi from the 24 and for that what I will do is um, we will transfer all the backpacks at, at least all the large backpacks uh, like capable of, of uh, transporting loot um, except maybe for you 
Oh man, man, no. We're gonna we're gonna only use those backpacks. Um, or maybe keep one or two. Uh, yeah, like that. And give the rest of the backpacks to the Usugi, and they can then loot the. fallen opponents so that yeah but because look how why is he so slow run speed penalty stealth penalty okay encumbrance right so you're gonna pick the lock of this Right. Yeah. Get him down. He's he doesn't stand a chance. No, you're gonna pick that chest. Alright, it's gonna count as stealing when we take stuff out of there, but I don't see any other chance right now. Um, well that's a little bit of food. Alright, okay, water jug, an empty grog can. We're not gonna need that. Um, building material. Small Emperor statue. No. Uh, what we're gonna do is okay. First of all, we're gonna, of course, get these guys down who are again attacking us. But they don't stand a chance, really. Yeah. They're getting some swings in, but nothing substantial. That that's a cool pose here. Looks really nice. And that's I think Toramasa with no, it's an MK2 only. It's a bastard sword. Okay. Um Well these weapons I don't okay, they are they are good for now and we bought them because we didn't have anything else at hand. But I don't think that they're gonna be um suited for us in the Wow that looks Whoa, that looks really nice. Um, but also, it doesn't. It's an S Tok MK2. But it's also not like really our style, like Asian or something. Um, I'm going to replace it with a really good katana or something. Yeah? Um, it's going to have the same effect. Uh, unless it's got armor penetration 40%. That's really damn good. And it's only got one kilo, so it's freaking fast. Um, yeah, we, we're gonna have to see, but yeah, we can worry about the style a little bit later. N right now, we must uh, worry that uh, we get the stuff done. Um, I just hope that there are no skin spiders coming, because as as I said, uh, we're gonna redistribute our our backpack situation now. So the so the twenty four are not encumbered anymore, right? Everybody move here. And we but we don't speed up, um, right? So no no no, stay here. Everybody go up here right and okay Shingen you got here leg injured and you're gonna make like that so first of all we're gonna put all these all right we 
we're gonna be moving here everybody in this room Gonna put them on hold. Right. And then we're gonna um, I'm gonna transfer the backpacks and uh, then be right back for you guys so you don't have to like sit in front of the screen just me switching backpacks. So I'll be back in a second. All right, everybody, we have begun to move back. Oh, come on. We have begun to move back the squad with the backpacks and All right. Thankfully that stupid spider lost interest in us. Seemingly. Going to attacking others. Oh yeah. These three you can attack because they can handle you. So as as I said before, I um I switched the backpacks to the Usugi. And Now we will heal up uh, our forces. Of course, only after be defeating these stupid spiders. Right? So, let's get them back. Okay, you're gonna pick him up and you move here. So that's gonna that's gonna be settled. And we are moving towards the last stand to sell off the loot and to get our bounty for this attack. And as night is falling, we're gonna make a break again. Um, it was just a quick update. We're going to make a break again until next morning because then the 24 are going to be healed. And we can see what lurks inside here. Um, I have to say, um, I'm not really sure if we really take on what's in there. Um, it depends on what comes out on the first attempt. Uh, it would be nice to get um, the the leader of the um, of the arachnids, but um, I'm I'm really I'm I'm not sure I'm not one hundred percent sure we're gonna get him. So let me get these guys to bed and the others into the fortress, and then we're gonna be right back. All right, everybody, we are healed up. I prepared a nice little ambush over here. And we have just, I think I just aggroed the big guy. And that's what I was fearing. If you look closely, he ha oh, he, he's coming alone. Very nice. Um, because they have spiders. Um, right? Okay. That's... Okay. The big guys are going to attack him. It's you. That's you. And the guys with the weapons that hit hard. And Nobuharu. Also gonna hit you. He 
There's no Tom. Okay. And you four are gonna attack him. So. I hope it's gonna be enough. Um, to be absolutely sure, I wanna, I wanna get her in as well. So because that is gonna be, ah, oh, that's f 94 damage. Okay, so you four gonna attack, and you also gonna attack. Yes, yes, come on, come on, don't let him hit you. Yeah, uh, yeah. Oh. Because that weapon, if, if, Jesus Christ. Come on, get him. Whoa, Jesus, what attack was that? Come on, get him. Get him, guys, please. Whoa. 131. Jesus, you have... This guy does 200 damage per attack. That's unbelievable. Oof. Wow. Thankfully we got him. And I am honestly... Uh, I'm honestly not sure if we should attack the... Uh, the security spiders. Because these security, what I have to say, um, I have the uh, not only stronger group in combat, but also uh, the. <laughs> and now I have a different problem because I don't have a backpack. Okay, but we can we can have it carried by some of the guys. That's not gonna be an issue. Okay, so who's gonna be, or who's, who's gonna have the honor of getting that weapon? Ah, you can carry it. Yeah, Torayasu, you fought brave. And let me take a picture of you taking down Red Recluse. So that is all right. So you gonna attack? You gonna attack? And you gonna attack? Oh no! Wait, wait. There is a spider. Jesus Christ! But no, I'm not. I'm not gonna risk it. If a, if a spider hits us right, uh, look at that dexterity and the strength. And it's 87 attack. Uh, it's 87 um, attack. It no, I'm not gonna take it. Blunt weapon. No. No way. What's the speed? It's 11 miles per hour run speed. Um, yeah, as I said, I'm not going to take any chances here. Uh, we're going to loot this guy. No, I'm, I'm not, I'm not taking it. We're going to loot that guy, we take their weapon. And we're gonna take that. Strange blood spider thing, okay. Where is the iron spider? I know. I don't want to risk it.
did he just do 268 damage with that weapon? Wow. Nah, we're not gonna... Okay, if if it should attack Sanada, no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, I hope we don't lose anybody here now. I really hope we don't lose anyone. Okay, that's 70 damage. Go away and attack again. Yes! 119 damage. Oh, we got it! But that could have gone much worse. Alright. Um. Yeah, and here we see again how much it, it matters um, if you have the, the attack speed. If you whoa. If you attack quickly Right? And you four gonna attack him. Right? And you in any case you're going to Oh, come on, give me somebody who is not encumbered. Well, he, he for sure hits like a badass with that weapon. But it's not effective. We're not going to use it. Yeah, we will. Yeah, we're going to wait until we uh, are a little bit stronger. He needs an 80 strength to wield it properly. But then he's going to be an absolute beast. Uh, right, Th 63, 60 out of 53, okay, so, what are we going to do, okay, we're going to, you're going to take that, where's that freaking spider corpse? All right, you're going to take it. That's some nice stuff. Nobushige, you're going to pick him up. And you're going to take those guys down. It's 151 for them. Not bad. Um. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be the picture for this episode. Wow, that looks cool. Perfect. So, and Red Recluse, you're gonna... You're gonna have an arm... gonna need all right 35 21 you're gonna not you're not gonna use it permanently anyway you're 
use it like that. Here you go. It's 15 kilogram. Nope, you can't use it. <laughs> All right. So we have the big boss. Um, and but seriously, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to overstretch our luck with, um, like, going in there and really provoking the guys to... Well, are you going to first aid him? And you're going to splint injuries. Right, and if you don't splint, you're going to kill that guy. Perfect. You're gonna take this stuff. And um, but and by the way, <laughs> selling all that stuff gave us 500 grand already. I j I completely forgot. I was so f f excited about um, fighting uh, an iron spider or a security spider. Man, the stats of that thing are really beastly. Look at that. That could have killed a whole bunch of us. Wow. All right. So, um, we successfully took out the uh, Arachnid nest. Um, I'm very proud of my of my warriors. And wow, we have a lot of stuff over here. Okay, didn't even see that. Um, I don't want to push our luck by um, eventually losing one guy. Uh, we we made our point. We killed the leader. Um, so that should bring them down drastically. Um, and yeah, I think. I think we are done here. We leave these few. We're not going to loot this place. Uh, that's all spider tainted. Let's let's get moving. Wait. Okay. 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 Why are you so slow? Right, pick up. Okay, we've got a speed 10. That is acceptable. And man, we got that made to weapon. That is... That is massive. That's really going to be 70k if you buy one. Jesus. All right. So, with us retreating uh, and leaving some iron spiders behind, Takeda Shingen is satisfied with the outcome of the attack they lost as far as I know they lost nobody no nope. they didn't lose one guy um, and were able to defeat red recluse and of course uh, Usugi Kenshin is be is gonna be wearing uh, red recluse's armor as kind of a price, uh, but also in addition, he needs a very good uh, chain shirt or something to wear underneath, because the 
arachnid armor uh, really sucks at uh, at Is that one behind? No. It really sucks at uh, stomach protection and we don't want to lose him just because of a stupid hit by accident or something. And yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode as much as I did. Um, the plan now will be um, I'm gonna I'm gonna do some some stuff like organizational uh, off screen, um, especially with the Togugawa. I'm not gonna jump around because I don't know if if Kenji then will crash again. It would be stupid at the end of the episode. Uh, the Tokugawa clan will uh, continue to start crafting. Um, the guys are all pretty good, so we don't need to train them too much. Um, and should need arise, the Tokugawa can uh, can re can quickly be armed. Um, and come to aid uh, our guys. We have, I think, two guys. Yeah, we have two guys practicing uh, armor smithing, and they are at 31 already, uh, which is nice. Uh, we let them. We start letting them craft uh, metal armor when they have reached skill 70, or maybe 80 only. I don't. I'm not sure. Depending on how long it takes, and 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 what the other plans are. Um, what we're going to do now is uh, I'm going to do a little bit organizational stuff uh, off screen, like I said, um, and then we're going to start that start this season two. Um, season two will be us exploring uh, some more areas and especially training the twenty four and training the Usugi. Um, making money to equip them with proper armor because even if that armor looks quite cool um, it's not very effective it's got only 90% head coverage that means 1 in 10 hits uh, goes directly through and goes to the head uh, it's got 100% chest coverage but it got no uh, stomach coverage whatsoever and also they have only these arachne pants which suck at leg protection so basically they have very very basic armor uh, and of course we're gonna change that um, so I'm gonna think about um, a uniform for the Yusu Usugi clan and uh, then we will go and find out how we can either craft it or uh, or buy it but buying good armor is is so freaking expensive uh, we we must find a good way but on the other side we have 500 grand yeah um, and eventually we're gonna do another uh, drug run or like like, like it um, an <laughs> an excessive drug run like for a million power um, for a million cats or something oh oh Go out, go out, go. You you don't want to provoke the shack. Jesus. Right. So. Let's see how. Let's see how Usugi looks. When he's wearing. The armor of Red Recluse. 19 yeah that's clearly better that's 35 39 55 okay it's got only 30% stomach protection um, it it looks cool but I'm not sure I'm really not sure. Um, that we're gonna keep in anyway. So maybe in the 24 there is someone 
no. No, we're not gonna. It's not gonna work. You need to stick with your with your samurai armor. You can use those pants for sure. Um, and you're gonna stick with that helmet also. Uh, okay, your helmet also got only 90, so you can stick with that for now. And yeah. So, everybody, thanks for watching and joining the journey of Takeda Shingen and his 24 generals so far. Um, in the second episode, um, it will stay like that. We're going to have a lot of action. Um, I'm going to skip sometimes um, a few uh, days or so to do off-screen stuff, mainly, let's say, like strength training or something. Um, also, I think this is something I'm going to do in between episodes now. I'm going to do some strength training, especially for the Usugi clan, because these guys are all pretty weak. Uh, to get them maybe to 40, 50 strength. And yeah, if you like what you saw, uh, leave a like or a subscription. Uh, that helps the channel an extreme lot. And until next time, Gnirk over and out.